Welcome to Dan ARG YouTube. This is now breaking news. Nigeria military don't go lucky to get. Begin shoot people for there. The innocent protesters where they there. They suffer, they do their protest. We no carry weapon. Nigeria, Nigeria military carry weapon go there. Begin shoot everybody. Switch off the light. Now I be waiting to happen right now, this night. So make I leave you, make you hear from Apostle Alfred Uyinosa. Hello, my people. Breaking news. Buhari and his agents have started killing our people in Lagos right now. Right now at Lekki Togate, the Turks, hoodlums, the soldiers sent by Buhari and Tinubu, they are killing our people right now in Lagos. Right now, they are killing our people. Buhari and his agents, they are already committing serious genocide against the people of Nigeria. People that demand for justice. Are you saying Nigeria does not have rights to voice out their pain? Are you saying we are not free to, say, to air our mind? We can't take it anymore. Breaking news, Buhari, Chinubu, and other agents, they are killing our people right now in Lagos State. Right now, they are killing our people in Lagos State. They switch off the security camera and the light right at uh, Lekki Togate. They have started killing our people. Why keep peaceful protesters? People protesting peacefully. Not that they destroyed anything. The federal government of Nigeria, under the supervision of Grandpa Buhari, he has ordered the military to start killing innocent Nigeria. What is all this? UN, our people in diaspora, we are putting all of you on red alert. They have declared war on Nigeria right now. They have declared war on innocent Nigeria right now. Lagos is on fire. Lekki is on fire. They are killing innocent Nigeria. They are killing innocent Nigeria. Our people in diaspora, this is what is happening right now in Nigeria. Are you saying the people do not have right to air their mind? They never pick up arms. They did not destroy government property. Why? They are killing our brothers. Lekki is on fire. They are killing our brothers. They are killing our brothers. They are killing our people right now in Lagos. Lagos is on fire. They've started killing innocent Nigeria. As I'm talking to you now, they have started killing our brothers and sisters. Right? Right. They are killing our people right now in, in Lekki. Please share this broadcast. They shut down the internet right now in Lagos. In fact, no live video right now. The people, so people are struggling. You mean we don't have rights to demand for justice? We are not under demonic, we are not under military regime. The time of good luck, the people came out to protest. But good luck did not order any army to start killing innocent citizens. They have started killing our people. They have started killing our people. Buhari, Tunubu, they have ordered the Nigerian army and they hired Oudlong, whatever they call themselves. They are killing our people right now. They are killing our people.
they have started killing our people. So, how is the situation right now in Lagos? Seriously. It's getting worse right now. Shooting now. I'm telling you now. And people there, they have refused to go away. They are spreading tear gas, shooting everywhere now. Okay. They refuse to go away. Okay. Six people have been declared dead. How many persons? Six. 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 Yes. You can imagine. But what about the okay. protesters? Did they leave the place? They, 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 they are still there. They are still there. I'm you. Okay. Okay. So I'm on live right now. I'm streaming live right now. I'm a show live, show live. I will, I will talk to you. Yeah, just come in right now. Immediately. Come in. Uh -huh. Yeah. The Bluetooth device is ready to tell. Please. The Bluetooth device is connected us successfully. They are killing our people right now. They are killing our people right now. You may say we don't get right to protest. Picking with the beat, let me not cry. It will cry. Picking with the beat will cry. It don't too much. It don't too much. People didn't let like it. They protest. They not destroy anything. Yes, talk talk to me, sir. You know what is? I beg talk. Hello. Yes, go ahead. Talk to us. Good, good evening, fellows, Nigeria. Good evening, sir. The state of the nation. We have a president who has no the fear of God in his mind. We have a president staying there, allow people to perish. Look at what is going on in Lekki. Police are killing Nigerians. As I speak to you right now, about six people have been declared dead in Lekki. Okay. They have put off the light. They are shooting tear gas. But yet Nigerians have refused to go away. They can never kill everybody. Because this is democracy. We need to protect. We need to let the world know that we are having a bad leadership. And this is the time for we used to rise up. They can rise up. All these first men rise up. They cannot kill all Nigerians. This is the time for we to protest and let the United Nations intervene in our matter. Yes, sir. Okay. So, uh, apart from Lekki, which other area? Yes. There are some uh, there are some there are some areas in, in Lagos we have in our bullet bar about one person has been declared dead. That one was that one was done through those the uh, political talks. Okay. And in some areas in, in Yanapaja, in some areas in um, Ireland, we are, there are some reports that people have been declared dead through spray bullets. So it, 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 it is so terrible, sir. It's so so terrible. In a country where we have the president, they cannot even utter a word to the Nigerians. It's bad. It's seriously bad. As we speak now, there's 24 hours coffee that have been declared by the Lagos State government right now. Yeah. And youth have refused to abide by that coffee. Even as I speak, even in Kenya, all the youth, they have resorted to the streets. They are shouting. Hmm. It's so serious, sir. So serious. It's so serious. Okay. So please, so serious. if you can get the touch to uh, with uh, to other persons, let them call in because everybody need to get first hand information. I can't even sleep right now. I can't even sleep. I'm, I'm telling you, it's so serious, sir. Very, very serious. All right. Thank you, sir. I'll, please. I'll, 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 I'll call you back to give you more available information. All right. Please do. All right. Please mm -hmm. do. All right. Yeah. Option of the year. Under this hardship, they are killing people. They never keep people rich. Hello, sir. Yeah, God bless you, my brother. How are you? I'm 
So I'm on the, I'm on live stream right now. So what's the situation? What 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 can I report you have gotten so far? So how far? Okay, um, right now as we speak, I've not gotten um, a real statistics of people are saying five people are dead, people are saying 15 people are currently dead. Okay. People are saying that um, the army refused, uh, refused uh, the ambulance from gaining entrance to where the protesters were so that they could just uh, give the first aid treatment to them. I have been communicating and so I'm not happy with what's happening right now in Nigeria, especially in Lagos right now, as we speak. And on that note, I've been asking the other way to help me. I since the president has refused to enter out, that means the vice president should step down. On that note, I'll be carrying out. Even the talk is never stable. Or see by your vice president, you kept quiet. That the Adeboye, please call your son to order. That the Adeboye, David Oyedipo, Olukoya, uh, the other man, uh, the deeper life, uh, Kumui, Paula De Farasi, Mike Okoko, Una keep quiet. Una keep quiet. That the Adeboye, you are in Lagos right now. Call the call the people to order. That they are deboy. That's why you are in Lagos. You cannot be in Lagos, and they are killing our people. Call your son, the vice president Yemi Osibajo. Call him now to call the military to order. Since the president is not talking, your son is the vice president. Daddy Adeboye, call your son now. Call your son now. Call your son now. Then a kumui. Paul Ade Farasi, Mike Okunkwo, we are calling on you people. Camp President, PFM President, you people should start talking. You people should start talking. They are killing our people right now, right now. No belay tight and offering. We are not going to make it on a matter. It is not only tight and offering matter. We are going to put for head. Live people are dying now. We are keep quiet. That they are deboy. All of them are come out now. They are come out. This is not the issue of Titan offering. If that to the thing they cost now, now on a Tuesday could rise up. Enough, we can't take it anymore. Please, 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 please. That they are deboye. Call your son to order now. Call your son to order now. Call your son to order. Call the vice president. That the EIA deboye. Call Professor Yemi Osibajo to order right now because because. <laughs> Is getting out of hand. The full and in nationality movement for uh, Feldman take full responsibility for the attack by fire method out to protesters in Abuja today. By tomorrow, the operation will continue. We hereby order our order our uh, cause across the country to mobilize for battle we have all waited since the past years so that it will say the full and caliphate they have they have declared war on nigeria they have declared war on nigeria they have declared war on nigeria it is so clear it is so clear it is so clear they have declared war on nigeria they have been attacking innocent citizens right in abuja supervised by some dss officials the video are there the video are there hmm. See the majority people supporting the talk. See them, see them. See them, see them. 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 See them.
Nigeria, you see what is happening right now? The politicians, they have deployed the talks using government vehicles to start attacking innocent Nigeria. Are they saying we are not free in our land anymore? We can't take it anymore. It is time to act. Now, we are calling on U UN. We are calling on our people in diaspora not to keep quiet. It's getting out of hand. For the past two weeks, our people have been on the street. No statement from the president. No statement from the president. I'm using this opportunity to call on all Christian leaders. This is not a time to play religion. This is not a time to play denomination. This is the time to speak out against this evil going on in Nigeria. Enough is enough. Enough is enough. <laughs> We say no. We need freedom. We need freedom. We say no to these killings of our people. Please. The UN should come in right now. The religious leaders speak out. You people silent is creating more havoc for the country. Yeah, my brother, God bless you. Wow, the police brutality don't talk to war. Why are they killing our brothers now? So I don't know. What do we do? Uh, what do we do? We need to let the government leave the Nigeria people alone. Nigeria needs uh, liberation. We need freedom. The people when go to prison, go to destroy prison, not we send them. And people when they go to keep for letting out, not be the cause this calamity, not be the cause this war. Why are they trying to just kill all the old youth now? Our old leader needs to resign, sir. Mm. I agree with you. I'm sick and tired, though. Yes, I agree with you. Now, never. We have to rule it, or leave it forever, because the system is brutal now. Yeah. People, when you know they, when you know they destroy everything, and I think they kill them offline. Yes. Shooting guns. And we now have the police, the police, what did the rest people do? All those talk, say we don't like them. And now the police have become the dust. Soldiers have become the talk. The government of Lagos State have become the talk. So who do we blame now? Hmm. Hmm. That, that everywhere get at the view. I'm sick and tired though. Yeah. So we just need to keep talking to put our people on red alert. Okay. All right, God sir. will save us from this calamity. Amen. No. Because Nigeria is not wise. Yeah. Nigeria is no longer, no longer analog. 
can't agree with the visitor, the whole world is watching him. Yeah. If the US cannot intervene to this thing, that means they are the people that is planning this crime in this in Nigeria, in Africa, not only Nigeria. I agree with you. Yes. Because agree you see the leaders now, they are rejoicing and enjoy, and I'm blaming the youth right now. Why did they want to go out the police police station? Why buy? So what you are, Tinubu has said, Oshomole has said, President Buhari has said, they just do this day when they stole our money, and money they grind, they up. They have to go out the police police station. Sir. Talk all what they took from us from them. Let the, uh, the international community fashion their family. Then let them find the officer. In this country, president in this country, we don't have president. To bring is no longer existing. I'm not president. What is cooking? I beg, help us share this video. Share this video to friends and family. Nigeria military open fire on innocent protesters. We be say they no carry weapon. They do their protest quietly. Sit down for Lekki toll gate. Bohari. Bohari. Well, I beg, make una help us share this video. Thank you for watching Dan AIG YouTube.